Hi, Kevin. How you doing? All right. So I'm just looking at your writing here. So everything makes good sense. Thanks for describing your designer's intent as well as your technical approach here. And there's one thing I want to um, I want to address uh, right here for the font column. What I'm saying is I felt the other good thing looked good in the overall background, but I don't see cyan type that you're you're talking about. For the font color I want with cyan, as I feel the other color didn't look good as the overall at good at all over the background. I'm still thinking about fading the background. I do not recommend fading the background image to try to help pop the type. I don't recommend doing that at all. Let's go ahead and take a look. I'll, I'll, I'll address these comments. But um, I, I, like you said, you, you said in your writing that you tried to use cyan, but I'm, all I'm seeing is gray. And I think that's problematic. I think that's really drab. I think a little bit of color will add a lot of visual engagement here. So let's go ahead and take a look at the end. I'm just trying to get it into the... Okay, well, let's go ahead and take a look at the end. I think it's an excellent start. Really great job masking. That's a really great image. Both images complement each other beautifully. I think it's a really, really nice job in terms of technical proficiency in adjusting and presenting the images. Great job there. Okay, page mechanics are very, very good. There's a one, a couple of things I would recommend doing, though. I think right now the bottom of the page is really cluttered, um, and there's a little bit of visual. That's a pretty visually weighty um, uh, image right there, plus the weight of this and the address. It's just there's a lot of, of, of we call it visual clutter, and that's basically a technical term that refers to a lot of visual elements converging together on one specific area of a composition. And I think this area is quite densely packed. There's something we can do here to, to alleviate that, that uh, uh, weight distribution. We can take this address right here and just compose it right at the top of the ad right there okay and then that was going to that's going to entail moving the body copy down but that's okay that way you can take the logo itself and move it down here in this position right here so we have logo masked image address and contact information up top okay that move this down take your subhead and move it a little bit closer to your headline because they are very very closely related so in terms of proximity they should be closer together Start your headline about where the subhead starts right there. And then uh, again, so you have headline, subhead, left line. Try purple. I think purple would be great. We'll also cause some nice, uh, create some nice continuation to the logo. So, and then, uh, and so we're going to move that down a little bit. Body copy will be moved down a little bit. Don't work. The, the, the body copy is perfectly legible. Um, that white over the green and the blue, perfectly legible. Don't worry about legibility. I, I don't see it being an issue at all. But once you move your entire text block down, your body copy is going to be about right here. I would recommend this is too short. These, these text blocks is too, are too short. I would bring it out to about at least the end of the subhead right there. And um, consider maybe adding just a little bit more of description in the um, re describing the actual uh, promotional offering. Um, Okay, so other than that, I think it's just really fantastic. Try those changes. I think it's going to be fantastic. I really do. Another, um, let me see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try those changes. I think if you if if you still feel there's a little too much weight at the bottom of the page, try a different um, a different uh, logo. Maybe the cyan and, and purple logo, the full color, or the, the, the one with the cyan and the purple in it. I think that might work out very well. Okay, so those are my recommendations. As I said, it's a fantastic start, but go ahead and try to employ those. If you want to re if you want to address those comments and resubmit, I'll be glad to make additional comments. But at the very least, I'd like to see these changes reflected in your final uh, magazine ad, uh, which is coming up here in, in uh, a couple of weeks. But I, I, I would definitely like to see this um, after you make the changes. So go ahead and make those changes and repost and we'll take a look at it um and okay all right kevin great job great start thank you very much of course if you have any questions at all please let me know i'll be glad to make any necessary clarifications thank you very much